All right, welcome to round one of our Aether Revolt draft. This hand is terrible. I'm going to mulligan it. Oh, this hand's better. Look at that. We can get a 2-2, make it a 3-3 on turn two. I'm going to put you on the bottom. I hope you never come back. Spoiler alert, we're not making this a 3-3. We're going to save this for a special occasion. Oh, maybe we just wait. We get to scry next turn? Yeah, we don't have any pressure. We're just going to wait, play this, and then play this guy, draw a card, and get a scry. So many things. This card does a lot. I'm going to take two from a turtle. One from a turtle, I guess. They can't even revolutionary rebuff this bad boy. Oh my god, scrying every turn and limited. That's so OP. Uh oh. Ooh, ooh. That's a 2 2. Man, we get to scry. Oh my god. Oh, that's pretty good. <clears throat> I'll keep that guy on top. Oh, uh, we can actually shoot this guy. I think we're just playing Renegade here. And then we're going to draw a card. Oof. This is the most real value I've ever seen. Next turn we can Iron League Steed, draw a card again. And then play Oath of Ajani. Make a 2-3-3s two, three, and a 2-2. Two, two. That seems good. We just have to make sure we're not dead by then. We might just block this Watchful Automaton if they attack, though. Oh, they didn't attack with anything. I guess if you're only attacking with the turtle, there's no point. So, do we keep this guy? Yeah, it's a dude. We can keep it. Yep. Wow, this is a this is some real advantage here. Uh, let's make a servo. And it'll pass. Next turn we can play Hawk, draw a card, and play Oath of Adrani. Oof. Can you imagine? Oh. Alright. Well, that's cool. Man, I was getting all excited about my Oath of Johnny. Which would put, you know, if we play Hawk, it'll put four counters on things. This guy also puts four counters on things. And uh, you get a 4-4. Four, four. So that's cool. Not sure we actually can win now. I love Virgil's Gear Hulk. It's just a card where they're like, hey... Um, I know you thought you had a chance to win, but, ooh, you don't really. Oh, okay, thanks. Yeah, and I think Deftus Missile is one of our only forms of removal here, so we're going to put this on the bottom. Draw another one anyway. All right. We can play Hawk. Yeah, it's fine. So much value from... Everything that's not our... Oh my god, so many lands, too. Eight lands. Yeah, we're just going to Oath of Ajani here. On the bright side, all our Planeswalkers cost one less. So that's something we can really get excited about. <clears throat> Death Dismissal has gotten worse. Oh. Okay. Uh, so, Virtuous Gear Hulk into Barrel's Expertise. Yeah, that's cool. Um, yeah. That's... Oh, you didn't even play anything for free. Wow. Okay. Uh, I'm going to go to the next game. And uh, ideally, we don't lose two back-to-back -back rares, maybe? I had two rares as well, so I don't know what the problem is. Uh, I don't think... I guess we could add Implement of Improvement. It would gain us two life when they're attacking us for, like, 16. Um, so if we're, like, at four, we can go to six. That's pretty good. It's not that good. Um, oh, boy. <laughs> don't really have anything here that... Uh, 
All right, well, we're just going to submit. Maybe they got lucky. I, who knows? They had a turtle into another dude, and... Uh, uh, all right, I was real excited. We drew our, uh, our scry rare. Oh, they're mulligan into six. They've basically lost. They can't compete with our 3-4 drop hand. Turtle. Alright. One more land and then we're good. And then we got this game on lockdown. Lockdown. Oh, that's a good one. Wow. Look at this combo. One drop into two drop that proliferates. Why does it just say proliferate on here? Oh, look, a mobile garrison. Well, this turtle's gonna get absolutely humongous, unfortunately. This is how it ends. Virgil's Gearhulk into Barrel's Expertise into Thriving Turtle Combo. Oh my god. This is not how I imagined things going. You know, when you're young and you imagine playing Magic in the big leagues, you don't you don't think this is how it's going to end, you know? With a durable handicraft and taking four and then having turtles that get bigger. Oh boy. Always with these first rounds. I'm always My first round luck is always the worst. Can you imagine how many drafts I would have to do if leagues didn't exist? I would have to be like, alright, we'll do a whole nother draft because I lost in the first round. And that's what actually happened quite frequently. It was very frustrating. Because I don't think a deck is bad just because it loses in the first round, right? Like, if you lose in the last round, deck is still fine. You just lost in the last round. But when you lose in the first round, it's pretty rough. Okay, well, 4-4-4... Four, four, four. X spell needs creatures five drop. That is rough. I mean, we kept the hand with a bunch of four drops, but I don't know. We probably could have mulliganed. Ugh. I never want to blame like randomness or the shuffler, but but I'm going to. No, I'm not going to. Uh, we take it five next time. We go to seven. Yeah, we're just gonna we'll play it out because that's what that's what you guys are here for. But I don't feel good about it. Yeah, okay. So every game turn five, Virgil's Gear Hulk is where we're at right now. I'm gonna. Now we're gonna three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We go to three. There's no, literally nothing we can draw that would stop this onslaught. So that was a eight minute round one, and uh, hopefully we'll have better luck in the next two rounds. Thanks for uh, dealing with that. I'll see you guys later.